we'll go back to our algebra 2 exponential functions lesson 7 mindful manipulations of percents home review part 3 please make sure to catch part 1 2 if you have not done so already especially part 1 which we go over the formula we're going to use to help solve these problems number 7 an object speed decreases by 5% for each minute now keep in mind decreases by 5% that is slowing down. Which of the following is close to percent that is speed will decrease over half an hour? And so our time unit N will be one minute. Well, each minute. So actually N becomes for the half hour, 30 minutes. Okay. And so our R value will be a negative number, negative 0 0.05, <clears throat> because we're decreasing by 5%. And of course, K, we do not know. So again, we use 1 plus K is equal to, in this case, we're going to have, and probably K will be a negative value, so that's what we're looking for as well, too. Is this okay? If we, get, if we get a negative value, it's okay. <clears throat> and so here we have, Parenthesis one plus negative zero point zero five or to raise the thirtieth power. And so here we're gonna take a look and use a graphing calculator. We will have parenthesis one plus negative zero point zero five raised to the power of 30 because it's 30 minutes if we decrease it by five percent every minute and we get in this case 0 0.2146387639 okay definitely a small number so we have one plus k is equal to 0 0.2146387635 dot 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 and we're tracked by one and so we're going to take a go back to a graphing calculator and we'll subtract by one because we have this answer already here so minus one the answer minus one and we'll get a negative value negative 0 0.785 and of course it probably the numbers afterwards so we end up getting this value here k equals negative 0 0.785361236361 and to change percent we're going to do a decimal slide of two spaces to get this here we take a look at the three and we see we're not going to have a change so we have k k is equal to negative negative 78.5 percent which will round up to negative 79 percent so that would be choice two now you're saying what about the negative well the question is which of the following is close percent in speed will decrease over it will decrease the negative is going to be the decrease here so we're going to decrease by 79 percent from the very beginning now so okay number eight over the past 10 years the price of corn has decreased by 25 percent per bushel assuming a steady percent decrease by what percent does it decrease each year round to nearest 10 percent and so we see here decrease by 25 percent means our r value would be a negative number negative 0.25 and our n value will be 10 years. Actually, r is not point, negative point zero two five. that's my k value. Oh, so sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. We want to find r, we will find the annual rate. So that's the unknown value. So <laughs> almost made a big mistake. So we're gonna have in this case, one, plus negative 0 0.25 is equal to 1 plus r raised to 10th power, which really is 0.75 equals to 1 plus r raised to 10th power. 
we mentioned that to be able to get one plus r by itself, we're going to raise both sides to the reciprocal of the exponent, which is the reciprocal of 10 is 1 tenth. And so now with a graphing calculator, we're going to find the value of 0.75 raised to the 1 tenth. So we take 0.75. We're going to raise this to the 1 over 1 over 10. Raise the 1 divided by 10. And we get, in this case, the value of 0 0.9, sorry, sorry, 0 0.971641659. And so this value is going to be the, in this case, the, the 1 plus r value. Okay, so we have in this case 0 0.97164. Oops, sorry, my handwriting is pretty bad. 164165.79, and of course, the numbers afterwards equals 1 plus r. Now we're going to take away 1 from both sides, minus 1 minus one, and we're gonna find r. Now we're gonna keep everything the same here. So just have a graphing calculator. We're gonna just take, take this value, the answer minus one. And we're gonna see in this case, a value of negative 0 0.028358342121. And this will be the decrease in the rate. So negative zero, Point zero two eight three five eight three two four two one three four two one dot 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 and to change to a rate we're gonna do a decimal slide by two and we see in this case the three because we're looking for nearest ten percent will have no effect on this so the R is a decrease okay so R is equal to a negative negative, uh, in this case, 2.8%, okay, or a decrease of 2.8%, so. Decrease of 2.8% annually. Sorry, my handwriting is pretty bad. So hopefully you hear what I'm saying. All right, so, now assuming this percent continues, by what percent will the price of corn decrease after 50 years? Well, the end value is now 50. And so we're gonna take the one plus R and raise the 50th power. So really it's gonna be equal to one plus negative, negative 0 0.028353, Five eight sorry five eight three four two one dot 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 and we're gonna raise all this to the fiftieth power and the very nice thing is we have this number already set in our in our calculator actually it's it's our we actually have this one plus that already set up so here the answer we're looking for this one plus this rate is actually back to here so we're gonna take this here. Enter, and we're going to raise this to the 50th power. And we get, in this case, 0 0.237304688. And this would be, so one our 1 plus r, is equal so it, so in this case the our total value actually our value will be in this case and by the way is one plus k is equal to zero point two three seven three zero four six eight eight dot 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 and the idea is that the k is going to be the change over time so we will subtract one from both sides. Again, what percent will the price of corn decrease? So in this case, it'll be 23% of the original, 20.7% maybe, but we take away one. So we'll just go to a calculator, 
take away 1, minus 1. And the total decrease after 5 years looks like, in this case, negative 0 0.76269531. Okay, I'll write that down. So our new k value will be negative 0 0.76269531. Dot dot dot. And to change the percent to decimals, pit slice slide. Uh, and once the nearest round to the nearest percent. And so we're looking at this two. Not enough to round up, so our percent change in k is equal to negative 76%. Or we would say in this, this case, the percent decrease in the price, not ion, but in the price of corn. Oh, my hand is terrible. In the price of corn would be about 76% after 50 years. This is pretty dramatic, pretty dramatic price change. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so we see that here we're able to find out the annual rate of decrease and then see what impression that has because we'll take that to the 50th power and one minus that result will tell us the decrease value. Okay, and this is the end. This is the end of our algebra 2 exponential functions lesson 7, the mindful manipulation of percents home review part 3. And I really hope this was helpful for you guys. And you see how the different the different techniques really the same same equation being used twice but in two different ways. All right. Uh, and if it was helpful, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. You know if that when new videos are added. Totally look forward to hearing any questions or comments you have and I hope this was super helpful. All right. Thanks so much for watching ladies and gentlemen. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care and be safe.